here in this video we would like to derive an equation for the variation of density of liquid with respect to temperature right we know density of any liquid can be written like mass by volume one thing you need to understand is even if temperature gets affected even if temperature changes it is the mass that always remains constant mass of a material doesn't depends on temperature but volume gets affected so i can write density at 0 degree centigrade as mass by volume at 0 degree centigrade density this is at 0 degree centigrade at t degree centigrade density t can be written like mass remains the same but volume at that t degree centigrade how these volumes are related for a given liquid i can write a formula gamma of the liquid as change in the volume by vernal volume per 1 degree centigrade rise in temperature that implies i can write vt minus v0 as gamma v0 into t vt can be v0 plus gamma v0 into t that is v0 of 1 plus gamma t i know the value of the vt so if i do something like dt by d0 dt means m by volume at t by m by v0 this is m by volume at temperature t volume at 0 by m m and m can cancel so density at t degrees by density at 0 degree centigrade is volume at 0 by volume at t but i know the value of volume at t can be written like v0 of 1 plus gamma tr delta t change in the temperature if is, this is t minus 0 actually i am writing in general delta t v0 and v0 can be cancelled so dt equal to d0 by 1 plus gamma delta t is a general format for the variation of density of a liquid with respect to temperature in the place of gamma preferably we shall take gamma r but anyway if gamma r is not available you can take whatever the available gamma of that gamma r or gamma a we can further write dt we have got it as d0 by 1 plus gamma into delta t to rationalize that we can multiply that with 1 minus gamma t and divide with the same 1 minus gamma t so what happens is d0 of 1 minus gamma delta t by this is a plus b into a minus b that is a square minus b square you know a plus b into a minus b formula so dt is equal to d0 by 1 minus gamma delta t 1 square is 1 minus gamma square delta t square but you know as gamma is a small value gamma square is very small and that can be ignored for an approximation then i can write dt is approximately equal to d0 by 1 minus gamma delta t by 1 minus everything else is ignored so this is another way of expressing density when compared with the previous way but i want you to be i want you to understand one thing carefully that this is a exact relation perfect relation whereas this is a approximate relation this relation is approximate you can get an approximate answer when you do this but when you do this you will get a exact value that's how the variation of density with like with temperature for a given liquid can be identified and solved thank you for watching